Andrew and Lindsay, good morning. It's Hi. lovely morning. to meet the pair of you. Thank you. Uh, congratulations on finding Dory. Obviously, it's uh, it's made a bucket load of money. Yeah. It's broke loads of records. Yeah. But most importantly, it's a really good film. Thank you. That is most important. That is the most yeah, important. Exactly. I, like I mean, the other things help as well. Yeah, it doesn't hurt. We're not yeah. complaining. Exactly. So why was the right time, you know, now, 2016, to make this Because sequel? it happened to be when I came up with an idea, I, I really didn't think I was going back there. I went on to do other films, and uh, I, I really don't have a... a, a an interest in sequels naturally and so I was surprised myself when I had to watch the film again in 2011 because they asked us to watch a 3D release of it. They, you had to, they forced you to watch yeah, it. Yeah, I had to approve it. I had to approve it, seriously. Yeah. And, uh, and so I sat in the theater and I hadn't done that since 20, uh, 2003 and I watched it like an audience member and I walked out going, I'm so worried about Dory. I, she, she doesn't know where she's from still. She could lose Marlon Nemo tomorrow. She still apologizes for her short-term memory loss. So the writer in me, um, and almost the, the parent in me who had created her, just felt uh, so unfinished. I felt obligated to like uh, finish her and, 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 and give her closure and, and let her be at peace. Um, now, I don't want to spoil anything, and obviously there's a lot of uh, wonderful old characters, wonderful new characters, mm -hmm. but can we please get a spin-off film for The Clam? That they, they are have you, an Are you just saying that because swear, it's his like, voice? Are you just baiting me? Oh! Did you not actually? know no, it's his I voice? Did not know oh that. god, now he's gonna do the whole thing. Go. Do it. Do it. <laughs> well, Owen, yes, this will be the most annoying interview you'll ever do, because I won't shut up now. That's perfect. So I, tell <laughs> me about yourself, Owen. <laughs> tell me all about yourself, Owen. I'm gonna go. I'm just gonna do this. I'm just gonna sidle off. I just blew up the mic. The sound gonna, man's ears are bleeding right now. I'm just gonna quietly you know? leave the room. Yeah. I honestly did not slowly back know away that. from you. Well, you're the first person to ask for him to be in an, in a, in an offshoot. Yeah. That's that awesome. was that was one of my favorite scenes. That's I hilarious. It's a good, a good one. Laugh at why, that one. Shelley, why? Then, then you it's have good. a very sort of masochistic point of view about watching movies. Well, I was wondering where do you find that balance between obviously you're telling a story and there's uh, a lot of important messages as mm -hmm. well, but then you have one little scene like that that's kind of, you know, it's fit in there and it, it you know, it feels slightly different, but it also adds something really mm -hmm. important to the film. Uh, that's half the fun of making these movies is just finding all these little moments and flavors that um, hopefully aren't gratuitous, uh, that they, act, they add to a greater whole, but it's like a meal, right? You know, there's like little choices and spices and they, and they all kind of add up to something. You're always trying to make every moment feel like you're the best moment of the movie. And you can't actually do that, but you try. Yeah. You would, I always, that's my sort of litmus test. Can you just drop in anywhere in the movie and just go, oh, I'm glad I'm here. Obviously the voices are incredibly important in an animated film and uh, it's great that you just cast yourself in there yeah. uh, repeatedly. Repeatedly, right? yes. Because the emperors are crushing. And I think, <laughs> have you been the voice in some of the yes, films as yes. well? I have been, yes. So, have you ever been in an interview when you have that eureka moment and you just kind of think to yourself, yes, the person we're talking to is definitely the voice for the next film? We're thinking about that right now. Is that what you're wondering? That's pretty much yes. what I'm asking. Oh, and yes. Yes. I yes. feel like that's happening. Oh, I feel yeah. like we are okay. in that moment. This is on camera now. Oh, it's so already that's locked. It's that's already locked. Yeah. I moved on. Yeah, yeah you're like, it. you're in three films by yeah, now. Yeah, exactly. Yes. Happy yeah. days. Toy you're Story new, 18. You're, you're the yeah, new John Ratzenberger, let's just say yeah. here first. Excellent. Yeah. Happy yes. days. Uh, Finding Nemo has left a wonderful legacy and it's kind of. You know, it's influenced people, it's the way they talk, you know, whether they're shouting mine at something or <laughs> yeah. keep on swimming. Yeah. But have you ever eaten in any of the Frying Nemo restaurants? No, but I've the seen world? them online. I've seen the, uh, some interesting titles for d different stores yes. and outlets. Yeah. We, Frying we, Nemo, I've seen. You know, truth be told, we eat sushi through these whole films, like, with I would great eat there. relish. I would eat there. Eating yeah. Frying Nemo. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I Why think not? so. I'd give it a shot. Yeah. Now, one of my favorite voice performers in the film is, uh, is Caitlin Olsen. Um, you, yeah. Because yeah. I'm a massive fan of It's Always Sunny. She, oh, she's so and good. she is hilarious. That, she, she does so she, much improv. I wanted to cast her before I even knew I was doing Finding Dory. I just love her voice. She's well, such a great voice. Yes. Um, I have prepared uh, just a very quick quiz, because both of you guys are Pixar. Uh, aficionados. Oh, no. Um, okay. no, it's fine. It's All fine. Right. And okay. gone, it's fine. No, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Trust me, I've gone completely high tech. This is paper. I don't know. Okay. Um, I don't, wow. This Look is at that. It's quite noisy. I know. I know. We have I know. to write them down and then it compare notes. It was basically notes. how there, as far as I reckon, there's been 17 <gasps> Pixar films. Yep. Oh, but can you name them all? <clears throat> oh, yes. It's like the 50 states. Here we go. Ready? You can write them down if you want. I have a checklist here. No, we can just say, no. we'll, okay, we're go going to help each other. We're taking we, a community. Can we go in chronological order? Yes, we're okay. going Toy Story. Toy Story. Toy Story, yeah. A Bug's, Bug's Life. life. Mm -hmm. You can't Toy see what I'm writing. Toy Story 2. Toy Story 2. Mm -hmm. 
Monsters, Monsters. Yeah. Incorporated. Um, Finding Nemo. Yeah. Incredibles. Incredibles. Cars. Cars. Ratatouille. Ratatouille. Because it went Ratatouille and then Cars, right? Didn't yeah. it? Yeah, and then it went. Um, you might uh, have had something to do with Wally, right? Wally, yeah. Right? And then Up. Up. And then Cars Two. <gasps> then Cars Two. Then Brave. Brave. Monsters University. Monsters University. Toy Story Three is in there Toy somewhere. Toy Story Three was somewhere in the. That yeah, was back in all there. Up, yeah. Okay. Um, Monsters University, and then we had Inside Out. Inside Out. And we had The Good Dinosaur. Good Dinosaur. And we had yeah. Finding Dory. Finding Dory. How many do we get there now? I, I just, You've I just got them all. That's Did 17. Uh, yeah. That's uh, incredible. Yeah. Yeah. Excellent. Yes. I've got no prizes for you. You don't win oh, anything. Oh, wow. What um, the? All right. There you can oh, have and it. you just lost you your can... part in the next film. Oh, no. We, like, no. Yeah, that I can was go to the shops. I can get you a, a prize. On your part. <laughs> That's no problem. I will clearly go and buy you a like prize. We like toothpaste. Toothpaste. Got it. Well, listen, congratulations on the film again. Thanks a million. And it's lovely to meet you. Lovely to meet you. Good nice oh, video. Thank you. Oh, nice video. Again. Just keep swimming, Mom, Dad. Does this mean we have to say goodbye to Dory? I don't know why I thought I could do this. Dory, you are about to find your parents, and when you do that, you'll be home.